Hey guys, uh, I normally don't make video responses like this and this is kind of unscripted and I'm just going to try to edit this the way that I can, but uh, this is a kind of video response to I Am Lucid's uh, video on mirrors in VRChat. He called it Mirrors Ruin VRChat, but he also changed it to VRChat Mirror Dwellers because I think he saw, he maybe have saw my comment, maybe some other people's comments, how ignorant of a take his uh his title was his entire video rather and maybe offended some people i feel offended because it's and uh, I, let me explain he basically just made such an ignorant take about how people socialize in a social game he mocked people you know like and he, he there's one person where he interviewed and said that uh, they're failures basically because of the way they're, they're social socializing because you know they want to socialize in front of a mirror It's socially acceptable in this game to look at a mirror and like no one's gonna say anything But if you did that in real life, it's completely mm -hmm. different So in 2018 there was this meme called mirror simulator, right? And when people sit in front of the mirror uh, after that they're perpetuating that meme You know a meme that essentially killed the game, right? And by doing that not only are they making themselves look stupid But they're making the community look stupid with them mirror people are I like to think of them as NPCs You know like they're, they're kind of like background players. You can't really talk to them. They just sit there They don't really contribute much looking at people like that it makes me feel better about myself right because i know i'm not perfect but you know damn at least i'm not a failure right? now th there's nothing wrong with sitting in front of a mirror with other people and chatting because the great thing about vr chat is that you can be anything you want right you can upload your own avatar you can you know clone a public avatar you can do whatever and sometimes, most of the time, you want to see yourself, right? You want to see what your avatar looks like, what your face is doing. Because, some, you know, sometimes, you know, you don't even know that your face is doing an emote that, you know, you don't want it to do. You Sometimes you want to keep it on the neutral face. People like to do that kind of things, you know? And, you know, a lot of people like socializing in front of the mirror for various amounts of reasons. But for him to make this video and... To basically mock people and to say that the mirrors are ruining VR chat because most people go to the mirror to socialize. There's nothing wrong with going to the mirrors. Okay. Most, if if not like the vast majority of people that I've met and have added to my friends list, and some are even my best friends or just a really close friend group, I've met because of mirrors. That's where I vibe, okay? I, like, here's a great example. I have a video, one of my most popular videos, for some reason, is uh, when I met a Japanese uh, content creator. She's a streamer. Uh, she got really popular because of Outfox Gaming, I think the channel name was. He met um, this girl named Core, right? And she was, uh, if you know the big hamburger country uh, meme. Yes. America? Yes, America. country. Noise, 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 she went to the mirror, she happened to join, and I met her, and I got to hang out with her. And guess what? I have her added on my friends list, because I got to socialize in front of a mirror. And not only that, some of my best friends I met because of a mirror. I only play VR chat to this day is because one of my first friends that I met was in front of a mirror, and he's still one of my closest friends to this day because the first week I played VR chat we met in front of a mirror you see I am not the type of person to you know go around and just dance you know like I don't go to void club because everybody knows what void club is it's not you know what you think it is people don't go there to dance people go there to ERP and never have I ever like have you ever played that and not gone the same exact questions multiple games in a row like 
it's all about either have you done drugs before have you ever had sex or done a sexual thing uh what did you you know things you did in high school like 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 seriously like it's it's the most boring game like you play you can play like once or twice but the more you do it the more like the more boring it gets like why would you use those two examples you know it's such a boring game and such a i don't know you know and, and to really just top it all off just because you like to play a game for you know it being a game that doesn't mean everybody has to play the game worlds i mean yeah there are there you know the udon worlds the actual game worlds those are there for people who want to play a game but just because people sit in front of a mirror that doesn't mean that's all they ever do okay you know people like to like myself you know we have anxiety we have depression we have all these kind of mental problems and like someone like myself i tend to stay mute a lot of the time and i just go to a mirror and i kind of just chill there and vibe and because of my avatar i get you know people coming up to me they try talking to me interacting with me and whether i speak or not i still interact with them and i still socialize you know and that's totally okay and you should be okay with that you don't tell someone that is not that is not okay you know people socialize the way that they want and that and any way that they can you can't just tell people you're socializing wrong you're playing the game wrong when there is no wrong way to play vr chat just because it's called vr chat that doesn't mean you always have to be chatting okay it's a social game you can do whatever the fuck you want you can't just call people failures and uh degenerates and just boring people just because they like to hang out in front of a mirror you know a lot of people make friends because of mirrors for you to just make such an ignorant video like this really shows that you really just don't care what how people feel and what people feel like and what people think you know like when it comes to me like i said i have anxiety so it's hard for me to really talk a lot in this game i'll play it a lot but it's still hard for me to talk to people because i have anxiety and even if i come i become close friends with somebody it's still hard for me to really speak in the game because i'm always self-conscious about what i sound like or the fact that you know my avatar and when i speak up they'll think differently of me uh compared to before they hear me for the first time you know it, it's like a lot of different things and it depends person to person but that's just me at the end of the day you don't just go ahead make a video like this and just tell people how to play a social game you're basically telling them how to socialize okay people can do whatever the fuck they want and just because you have a problem with it that doesn't mean you have to you know tell people hey you're doing this wrong do it my way and go ahead and just make this kind of video and just you know just because you're a big youtuber and have everybody just kind of like agree with you you know like i left a big comment on your video i'll leave it on screens for you to read or anybody else to read and it gives more clear thoughts than what i'm doing now because i'm really bad at making videos like this especially unscripted but the point is don't tell people how to socialize don't tell people how to play a social game because there is no correct way to play this game people can do whatever the fuck they want leave them be let you do you and let them do them okay it's not your problem okay it's like what you said in your own video you leave the world because you don't like the people that are there because they're doing one thing or another. I do the same thing. The, like the whole people playing music in front of the mirror. Yeah, I, I tend to not like that. So if I have a problem with the people that are in that world, especially if they're in front of the mirror, then I'll leave. I'll go do something else. And if I have other friends on, I'll go see what they're doing. If I don't have any friends that I want to go see or that I can't even join, then I'll just find another instance and just try to meet new people. And if I, you know, can't do that, then I'll actually do one of those things that you said. I'll go to a game world. I'll go to you know, the movie world. I'll go to any other place. I'll just explore. I'll world hop. But if I want to chill and just vibe in front of a mirror, that's totally acceptable. That should be fine. And you know you shouldn't like mock and degrade people just because they want to do that like i said just don't tell people 
how to play a free social game, okay? You know, do whatever you want. Let other people do whatever the hell they want. And just do, like, leave them be, all right? That's all I gotta say. Have a good night, everybody. I think they both enhance and dehance uh, VR chat because, like, first off, there's uh, like I dance in front of mirrors, and mm -hmm. I think it's really fun because people join me in dancing, um, and people like to watch themselves dance, and that's really fun. We have a great time. We do the cha cha slide. We do, do that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then, but then again, people can sit in front of mirrors and not talk whenever it's a social game, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, whenever I'm sitting in front of a mirror, I'm always talking. I don't care. I will talk. I'm here to socialize. I'm here to dance. I'm here, like, to move. Like, mm -hmm. <laughs> For me, I just sit in front of mirrors and admire my avatar. And I yeah, vibe. Not... Yeah, I was just curious because I saw I, I, I saw a dude's video. <laughs> No, I saw a dude's video, uh, no. and he was basically just saying that mirrors were in VR chat. I'm like, kind of curious what nah. actual people think. Mm -hmm. I don't know, I just well, like looking at my avatar. I think without mirrors, the game would die. Because <clears throat> once you've experienced everything on this game, it gets boring. Mm -hmm. So I think with mirrors, it helps with social interactions better. Um, I've met a lot of my friends. In front of mirrors, you know, just because people are chilling. But I mean, mm -hmm, same. I don't think it ruins the game. I think it does uh, bring things to a more chill standpoint. But I mean, this game is, you know, it's VR chat. You know, you're chatting with people, whether it's in front of a mirror or if it's in a horror map. Mm -hmm. I think mirrors help a lot with, um, uh, like, uh, some people have like body dysmorphia, and I feel like them looking at themselves in a more positive light, even though their avatar is more of a healthy thing. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I meet a lot of depressed and social anxiety and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera type people on here, but like, I, I, I thoroughly enjoy being around them for the most part, you mm -hmm. know. I like when people are able to vent and stuff. Mm -hmm. For me, I'm a very happy, bubbly person. I'm, I don't have any disorders or anything like that. Mm -hmm. So it's like, if I can help someone else feel better, it's, you know, kind of a goal. I just, I don't know, this video that I saw is by a bigger mm -hmm. content creator. Um, I don't know if you've heard of I Am Lucid. Yes. Okay, he's the one that made that video. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, and I thought oh. it was such a ignorant take because he doesn't consider, mm -hmm. you know, the kind of things we just mentioned you know the type of people who have anxiety or just introverted mm -hmm. or whatever he's like these mirrors just ruin the game you know and i'm like no they don't a lot of people go to the mirrors, the mirrors are the game yeah yeah and like yeah and he brought up bad examples like going to void club or going to never have ever and i'm like out of the two things you get picked out of the entire game you choose yeah. the two that most people dislike. Avoid. Yeah. I'm sorry to butt in. Yeah, go ahead. Go but ahead. the thing oh, about VR chat is that even though you may have the weird stuff like the ERP people, which I don't mind, you know, you mm -hmm. do what you want to do. Exactly. The thing about VR chat is that it lets people be who they want to be. Like me. I'm short, I'm 5'9, I'm really skinny, but I can choose an avatar that's completely ripped and I can. I can, you know, play as that, and I can be confident, and, you know, I can, you know, socialize instead of having to be worried about being judged on how I look or what I'm wearing or mm. whatnot. It's just, you know, you can be who you want to be, and it's that's, that's the best thing. That's why I think that's the best. It's not the socialization. It's not the friends. It's the freedom of thought and the freedom of doing what you want to do in VR chat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. Like, I'm sorry about it. Oh yeah, no, that was that was perfect. That was like exactly what I've been thinking too.